Good evening, everybody. My name is Carol Toomey. I'm the Youth Services Chair. And under Youth Services, there's RILA, which is a leadership training weekend for sophomores. There's Interact, which is a uh, rot rotary type group in high school or earlier age group. And there's Rotaract, which is college age. We recently had an Interact training in January, first ever, well done. And now we have a Rotaract training, and I know this will be well done too. Thank you, Carl, for planning this. Uh, I know you worked very hard. The packet that you will be getting, or you already have, has everything that you need and you do not have to take notes. The presentations you will see are all in those packets. Any information you need are in the packets. So this gives you an opportunity to, to listen and not have to worry about taking notes. Tonight we're going to have a panelists talk for a few minutes. We'll have an opportunity to ask each questions and then we will go into some discussion groups. And now I'd like to introduce Jim Fusco, District Governor of District 7910, 2015-2016. Just a couple of words. They, they say the district government is talk and talk and talk and never shut up. But I'm going to uh, be very, 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 very quick. I just want to thank everyone for being here. It's a you know great honor to be here with you. I want to thank Carl Gomes for having a snowstorm three weeks ago on that Monday because I was out of town and I wouldn't have been able to attend this. So glad to be here. Uh, as a district governor, we, we, our years run from uh, 1 July until 30 June of the following year. And when I was, uh, became district governor on the 1st of July, I explained that my goal is to really concentrate on youth, that the future of Rotary, it's really the youth that's so important between the Interact, as Carol explained, and Rotaract, that's the feeder group for Rotary. And if we, if we can be successful with Interact and Rotaract, then we as Rotarians be successful going into the future. So uh, what, I, what I've done is I explained to Carl Gomes, and thank you, Carl, for your uh, efforts, and also our Interact chair, which is Ron Bott, that I thought training was going to be the key to doing, to getting our Rotaract and Interact clubs you know performing and you know help our future we've done that we in November we ran a interact training session very successful and I'm just so happy to have you know have a run tonight and Kyle thank you for doing a great job Steve thank you for your assistance and thank you and have a great day thank you, thank you. it was lucky that we uh, had to postpone because we wouldn't have had Jim and I always like to have Jim at these things. It's very important to have this, that the governor is giving the support to Rotaract. Um, I don't know if anybody knows the history of Rotaract, but it dates back to 1968. And it just happens to be the birthday is two weeks away from tonight, March 13th. So it's kind of appropriate that we're meeting tonight. The Rotaract Club was started in North Carolina uh, and does everybody know who Paul Harris was? Did, did the, and you know, Mike? The, he founded Rotary. And when he went to Australia, he talked about starting a, a youth group. He went to many clubs and talked about the youth group. And it finally started, as I said, on March 13th, 1968, 48 years ago. So I'm sure that there's going to be a big celebration in two more years and we'll be keeping our eyes and ears open for that. 